Today we're going to examine how intraoral scanners can be used to fabricate custom abutments and implant crowns. A custom abutment allows for patient-specific emergence profiles and anatomical shape. Traditionally, this requires an impression of a closed tray or open tray impression coping, followed by placing the analog and coping into the impression before pouring the working cast. The working cast is used to fabricate the milled or cast abutment in the lab. When using an intraoral scanner, you skip the impression and create a digital model of an implant scan body. The scan body is a post that attaches to the implant fixture and can be viewed above the tissue level. It represents the position and orientation of the dental implant. Scan bodies are reusable and might even be autoclavable, so you have to check with the lab of your choice to ensure they're working with the scan body that you have. You can order scan bodies from implant companies or your dental lab. You want to confirm that you know how to sterilize and how to use them. When scanning the scan body, it's crucial to get a good scan of the top, as this will determine how far under the tissue the implant extends. If the tooth is located behind the canine, scan the sextant up to and including the canine. If the implant will be an anterior tooth, scan that sextant. It's also important to do a tissue scan so the base is not lost as the scan is refined. Once scanned, the software can extrapolate the position of the implant based on the angulation of the scan body. Let's go through a case. After sending the scan to your lab through the internet, the abutment and crown are fabricated. You receive a working cast from the lab as well as the final abutment and crown. The implant crown delivery is as usual. Place the custom abutment, tighten to final torque, and cement the crown. Now we have a nice implant restoration through our CareStream 3500 scanner protocol. In addition to eliminating messy impression materials and saving your time, once you've captured an area of interest, you can immediately show the patients the scan on the computer. Helps them understand where they are in the process. Creating custom abutments is just one way an intraoral scanner can be also be used in surgical practices. They can be used to scan existing abutments, to create basic surgical guides, or to make mouth guards. Though scanners are still new to dentistry, they're gaining speed and changing the way dentistry is practiced.